Hello. Um, bit of a day. I'll tell you about it later in the vlog. Um, short version. I'm not where I'm supposed to be because of Sunday service and people not being able to get collect me. Because uh, the person I was going to visit lives in a village where there is no direct buses or trains from here and there was apparently a bus I could have gotten from where my family live um, but that bus wasn't running today being Sunday so huh. but to um, to make it less stressy or, or, or interesting or just something to do we got this instead so I'm all nice new shirt all dressed up and I thought well I'm not doing the shindig which I'm supposed to be at but at least I can I can be here with you and, and open my book of geeky goodness. Um, so first thing you'll notice, it's a wearable box. Uh, and long-term viewers, um, first of all, hi, thank you for being long-term viewers. Um, but also, I think if you're not a long-term viewer, you will know that I... If you're a long-term viewer, you'll already know this. If you're not a long-term viewer, then I'm going to explain it anyway. I basically stopped getting the wearables, not because I didn't like the designs of the t-shirts, but because I didn't want just four t-shirts every month. Um, I, I already was getting enough with my other geek boxes and everything. Um, I said, uh, I saw I cancelled my subscription, basically saying, um, the t-shirts are cool, but we need more variety. And I'm guessing a lot of people did that because they've relaunched the box. Um, so now they've got it a different way. Um, it is... Um, a guarantee of two t-shirts and then either a sweatshirt, a um, long sleeve t-shirt or a hoodie and then two or three of other so like uh, you know, hat, socks, gloves, necklace, scarf any, anything else that would come under wearable so either two or three of those depending on what they are I mean, I'm guessing if you've got like a nice hat and a, and a, a necklace, then it'll be two items. Or if it's like a sock glove, you know, scarf set, then, you know, maybe that'll be three. I don't know how they're working it out. Um, I'm pretty sure this is the first of the relaunch. Uh, no real clues as to what it is, except the big item is supposed to be a sweat sweater um, this time. So, um, yeah. If it is the one it should be, which should be, I don't know, I haven't had a note saying it's going to be late or anything. Um, but it should be this one. So it should be two t-shirts, a jumper, and then other. So um, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. There we go, just do the best bit first. Yeah, there we go. There we are. And we'll pop this aside. It is heavy. So it is either going to be the, the promised jumper or, or a sweater. So, um, or a hoodie, sorry. But we'll just see. Blue paper, of course, for Ravenclaw. Um, we'll go for this one first. Nice, big... I like that. I don't know what that is, but it's shiny. Um, so yeah, this is the, uh, the sweater. For clarification, um, because <clears throat> I've, it's had it, I've had it pointed out that sweater is a very Americanized word. Um, this, this material specifically, with the expand, you know, the uh, elasticated cuffs and that I consider this to be a sweatshirt if it's woolly I consider it to be a jumper that's just my personal preference so this is a sweater and what is the des design what is the design <laughs> oh that's cute oh that's cute I like that so it is um, a Quidditch design um, so you've got the See if we can do this. Got the goalposts up here. There's a snitch coming along over here. There's brooms everywhere. You know, more hoops over there. There's a lot going on on this. And the word you can read it, I'm a keeper, which I think is very cute because obviously if you, you know, you're with someone and um... oh yeah, there is a quaffle there. That's the big, big round thing at the front. Um, yeah, I can't see any beaters but then it would be too crowded. Oh no. Sorry, there's a lot going on in this jump. We've got a beater bat here. Um, obviously that's a snitch. It's a quaffle, I'm assuming. Um, and then, I'm guessing that's a bludgers with another bat there. So we have got a bit of everything on here. 
Um, I like the colour. Um, as I said, if, if it's not black, you know, it's nice to mix it up. And this charcoal grey works quite well. Trouble is, summer has hit England. As you can tell, I've got that that light is from the window that the curtains open, uh, and even that's cloudy. So summer in England is a great time. But uh, yeah, but we got we got. I'm like I like that. I'm happy with this. Um, next up, we've got T-shirt number one. Um, which is a similar charcoal grey, which I'm, again I'm fine with, and we have, oh okay, um, this is quite sweet. It's sweet in sentiment, but I'm not sure the execution on one of the um, the faces is quite. Um, apologies to the actor, I think, but it's uh, Harry and his parents. Um, so the, the, <sighs> I was looking specifically at his dad, James, looking a bit odd in that picture. I guess it's what happens when you take a photo and try to transfer it into a, this kind of art style. Um, Daniel's looking all right. He's it, he's coming off okay. But yeah, nice nice family portrait of the the boy who lived and his late lamented parents. Not much more to say about that. I like the colouring. Again, the, the grey t-shirt and the red contrast quite nicely. So there's that one. Ah, uh, see. We have a lovely blue one, really nice blue, because of course, let me double check, ah oh, yes, yes, so we are showing our pride, um, the cleverest and always the best, with the eagle one down there, so yeah we are Ravencore Claw of Pride really really nice color blue quite like that um yeah like the um i'm always a big fan of ones that sort of take up all the spacing and like big messy writing but this is cool i like this i don't have that many that have got that are just writing so that's okay but again big wear on the color you can see that in the sunlight i'm, I'm definitely a fan of that one i'll be wearing that one a lot Alright, so we also have something in here that um, caught my attention as being a bit shiny. Oh, that's really cute! Okay. Hang on, excuse the rattling. I'm trying to find the. Yeah, there it is. Um, it's, it's an exclusive, it's a beanie, and it is to go with our, um, our sweater. A firebolt, or. yeah. Whichever one. I like that, that's pretty smart. Again, summer won't be wearing it for a long while but um, obviously it's the internet so i've got to try it on that is really cute um my thing with this is i prefer caps i've got a bully hat with a peak on it because like the, they get quite bright on my eyes um but this is lovely and warm it fits quite comfortable nice and soft so uh, yeah i like that happy with that it's supposed to be or is there huh Okay, so they did announce that they'd have like two or three of other item, and there doesn't seem to be, but we'll see what the card says. Um, so we've got the broom beanie, the t-shirt. All right, no, it is the um, it is just the four items. Slightly disappointed on that simply because they had advertised upwards of well six items, I guess. But it's alright, they're good items. I mean, the jumper itself is going to be about 20 quid for a, for a 19 box. You can't complain. Um, hasn't got the prices on the thing for for some reason, but that's okay. So we'll say 20 for the jumper, 10 each for the t-shirts. So it's 30, and then the hat, 5 to 10. So we're looking at at least 40 quid, so we can't really complain. Um, so... I do okay. I like the jump. I like the Harry T-shirt. I like the beanie, and I definitely like the house ones. Uh, let's have a quick look at the other house um, ones if we can. I'll, I'll just read them out and then show you them. Uh, the bravest. Uh, okay, I can't read that at all. Uh, it's the it's the it's the yellow and red. So the bravest, where, oh, the bravest surprised, 
far beyond the rest, obviously, for Gryffindor. Hard workers are busy, worthy of, worthy of admission for Hufflepuff, and power hungry, love those of great ambition for Slytherin. Sorry, um, reading off of here, as you can see, some of the words on them are quite small, but Again, as a set, very bright and colourful, like that. Um, the highlight, um, the person highlight is uh, Kirsty Reads Kirsty's, looking very happy and lovely. Well done, you. Uh, the prizes this month's World Wizardry Box, we are giving away hundreds of prizes as well as some platform nine and three quarter Hogwarts Express signs from the Noble Collection. For your chance to win, just upload the images. Hashtag I love geek gear. So um, that's the prize. And the hint for next month is the burrow. So I'm, I'm not sure what clothing items are going to have for the burrow, but that'll be cool. Uh, and this lovely lady is on the YouTubes. So, um, what's her name? Uh, Geek Glitz. There you go. So well done, Geek Glitz, for making the magazine. Um, but yeah, we, we, um, I'm happy. I'm, like I said, if it's a disappointment, it's because um, on the website they're advertising it as, you know, two two of one, one of another, and then two or three. But maybe I misread it. Maybe it is one, one or two of a second. So that could be on me. But I like everything. All right, we'll pop the hat back on because I've got to do it. The hat is actually really cool. Um, which does thematically tie in with our jumper. And then obviously we've got our bright house t-shirt. Hang on, let's see if I can do this. And then our um our matching um our, our family a lovely Harry and his family um t-shirt, which is very sad. I can't imagine losing my parents before I'm old enough to really remember them. But here we go, let's see if we can do this. There you go. I've already got a shortcut picture, I'll take I'll take a thumbnail picture because I don't like um when my video puts spoilers in the thumbnails, so that's why I always change it to some of mine. But that's what we got, and maybe that's why I should take as a picture to show, to show off <laughs> the hashtag. But anyway, that's that is everything in the box. Um, actually, not a bad haul. I'm I'm glad if they keep this up. Um, two t-shirts rather than four t-shirts is fine, and then we get a choice of jumpers, hoodies, or long sleeve t-shirts. Which again, I like long sleeve t-shirts in the winter, it's good to have an option. And then, um, yeah, the beanie's really cute. Um, you feel free to follow me at here on Twitter, Phoenix11. That'd be very aw awfully nice of you. Um, subscribe if you if you feel like it, it'd be lovely. Um, like and share, it would also be very, very awesome of you. And then meanwhile, um, Thanks for watching. I always, always appreciate it. I've been Michelle, you've been listening, and I will see you next time.